Alright, what's going on guys, and welcome back to my Anime Last Stand Noob to Pro Season 2. In this video, we're going to be trying to get all the new units in this new World 3 update, and just continuing getting more OP. So if you like the video, make sure to sub, and yeah, let's start. Now, before we do anything, I already redeemed the code, so let's spend some rerolls on Freerun, because I want Avatar or Overlord on her so badly... That I think I've already spent like 500 rerolls on her. I know I should probably save the rerolls for the new units, but dude, I just have to. Dude, it's actually about time. For a second, I thought me and Freeman were going to have beef or something. But in these last 40 rolls, I'm going to roll off Shinigami, which I already know I'm going to regret. Can we get Overlord? Probably not, but... What a way to start off the video. This is my first glitch, by the way. Which, what are those chances? I, oh my god. I, I'm actually speechless. I'll rephrase what I said from last, uh, my last anime last end video, bro. Free to play is the way to go. Every time I use codes or just rerolls from quests, I get lucky. But every time I drop my life savings into this game, I get absolutely nothing. So... I'm not spending a dime on this video, bro. Give me another glitch. Give me a whole team of the glitch. Dude, I gotta level this guy up and get a skill tree ASAP because he's one of the best units in the game and I actually just got the best trait on him. Oh my god. But let me stop boring you guys with me just yapping. So let's go to world three and we... Oh, I forgot. I didn't play that kaiju freaking update. So now I have to do the kaiju story. Okay, this won't take long. Is that what I think it is? A story that takes 10 minutes each act, and they decide to add one time, 1.5 times speed and 2 times speed and other stuff, but not the thing that takes 10 minutes every single stage. They added 2 times speed to that, bro? Who would have thought? Oh, and it also turned out that they made Avatar, like, way better than Overlord, so now when you want, like, a pure, just, like, better damage trait now you want avatar which is crazy because last video i was hoping for overlord on satama 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 i don't even know uh but i got avatar but now avatar is like just way better so that's crazy. and i also got avatar on law bro what the hell So there we go, that's the last act finished, so that means show the English is not Englishing, but we should be able to go to world 3. I mean world 2. Alright, let's go bro, let's see all the, the new stuff. You're actually kidding me, they're making me do bare bones? For what? I already finished all the story, what now? Light work, light work, light work. So now can I go to world 2 or like what's the deal here? Enter World 2, yes, that's literally what I was trying to do. They added Joker? No way! Raids look the same. There's this thing, which I guess I'll check out in a sec. Obviously, you gotta fill up this whole shop with just a bunch of bundles. Three times speed! You need that cup? Bro, as, I, as I said last video, bro, this game brings out the worst in me. Alright, I don't know what to do, so let's read this new patch. Y'all get ready for this yap session. All right. At long last, new era has come to anime last. Here's everything we've added for this grand update: new world, two, new currency, new banner, three, new godly rarity, new game mode, elemental caverns, new mechanic souls, new crafting UI area, fifteen new units, three new story modes, new world, two quests, daily infinite mode quests, new AK area, new world, two entry challenge improvements, two times speed, twelve games, three times speed game pass, game pass gifting, new battle pass season, new music, leaderboard rewards, movement system revamp, infinite castle rebalance, one new enemy class, element reward. Okay, so this is pretty much just like ACD, where there's a world two story. So this first one is seven deadly sins. There's new Meliodas, but how do you get Escanor? Since he was like the big like insane unit in the trailer well it doesn't show so probably a different way aizen i'm also gonna have to get ilkiora because of his evo and fire force but it doesn't look like there's any drop for like shinra or something like that now before we start working on story and when it comes to all these new units i'm gonna be honest 
I can't be bothered figuring out how to get them, so I'm probably just gonna wait for a video on how, like how to get them and how to evo but them. Who I do know how to get is Ilkiora, and back in the OG uh, anime last stand days, I still wasn't able to get Ilkiora. So we're running it back on the new Noob to Pro series, and let's see if we get lucky on this account. It's only a 5% chance, so let's hope the game doesn't make it so in my case, it's like a 0.1% chance. Well, let's see how many runs this takes me, and guys, don't forget, this. at the end of the day, this is still a Noob to Pro, so I still have to go back to some old units like Pain, and uh, what's another unit? Rengoku, uh, just stuff like that. But yeah, this is definitely going to be a grindy episode, that's for sure. Second try! Second try! Well, he surprisingly doesn't need the Ilkiora sword or Ilkiora sphere, so I don't know what the point of those items were. Now, I'm going to be honest, these essence thingies, like for Escanor the fire and now with Ilkiora the nature, those stages are almost impossible for me right now. Like, I cannot solo that. So I tried to go on Discord, but World 2 is like region locked. Uh, I don't know what that means, but like you can only join people that are on the same country as you, which is why. So that just made it a hundred times harder to find people. So now I literally have no choice but to solo it. So I don't know what to do right now, but I guess I'll start working on story. One down. You saw nothing. I told you guys, this game brings out the words to me, alright? That bundle actually just burned my life savings, but if I get Benny Maru, I will forgive this game for being... To be honest, I didn't even have to do that, but come on, bro. Just give me Benny Maru. That's all I want. I would literally spend all 800 rerolls that I got on Benny Maru if I got him. Okay, I'm not even surprised that I didn't get Benny Maru, but there is a pity, so that's a relief. But I swear, I just... Please tell me he has an evo. Oh my god, he actually has an evo. Arthur is the go, bro. I have to evolve him. Before I go back to story, let me do like some... Like 50 cheeky little rules. Please be good, bro. Please be good. Well... I'll take that. But since I did say I do 50, let me see if I can get like a diamond or a golden. If I get an entrepreneur, that would actually be insane. W. But I'm actually so hyped that I got Arthur Avatar. And the fact that Avatar is literally now better than Overlord. So now I don't have to worry about that he's not a DOT because... Wait, hold on. Ugh. <laughs> Hey, and we also got the evil material for Shinra, so I, at least I don't have to grind for that. But I also just realized I did all of that without buying 3 times speed, so let me go do that. Well boys, we have officially beaten all of story, so you know what that means. From now on in the video, all we're gonna do is get stronger and more OP. But I'm gonna be honest, I can't start working on the new units yet. Like, I can start grinding for the new units, but not evo them, because this elemental thing, it's way too hard. And the fact that you can't even do it with people, which I think it's literally made for, yeah, I think it's safe to say that this thing needs a nerf. But by the time it gets a nerf, we're already gonna have all these un Okay, it just kicked me. Okay, what I was trying to say before the game interrupted me is by the time the game nerfs that incredibly hard mode, we're already gonna have all the new units, so let's start grinding. But what I'm gonna do is I'm probably gonna grind for units like Rengoku, Pain, and Shanks because these new units, Meliodas and Aizen, those drop rates are pretty interesting to say the least. So what I'm gonna do is I'm probably gonna set up an AFK for both of them so I don't really have to manually grind that. Even with three times speed, I already know that's gonna be mentally draining. But don't worry boys, we're still gonna be grinding for all the new stuff, all the new units. It's just right now that stage is just too hard. So for the first unit we're going to be grinding for is Rengoku and grinding infinites is also gonna be good. I get to grind my skill tree for like Sid, Saitama, uh, Itachi, but before I go grind the infinites, I am going to be evolving Griffith later, so let's get something good on him. Oh, 
Uh, I'll keep all sing for now, but if I have leftover rerolls, I'll probably spin on him some more because Griffith is still pretty good, but let me see if I can get something good on this guy too. Dude, look at that damage, what? That's perfect. So I just finished it infinite, I lasted around 230 waves, obviously I could have gone like way farther if I did like a proper team, but from that we got a secret portal and 11 of these. Now with the other, the berserk capsules, I got two skull knights and just like 60 capsules, so who knows, maybe the luck will be lucking. And we also got a Kaza, which is pretty sick. Okay, well I'm gonna be grinding a bunch more infinite, so we have to get that Rengoku, bro, because he's supposed to be insane. Oh, we also got some of the horns, so maybe at one point I'll be able to evolve that avatar Nezuko. Yo, I just got Rengoku, I didn't get to record it in time, but that actually took like 3 to 2 infinite, so glad that didn't take me a few years. But y'all already know, I gotta take advantage of the 4 times luck. I'm probably not gonna roll on a unit till it's next weekend, because this, I got, I would have never thought I would get a glitch, but yeah, the luck is lucking. Uh, obviously he needs a better trait because Rengoku is insane, but when, like, I get Meliodas and Aizen, I think I'm gonna want to go for, like, Avatar, something like that, so we'll save the rerolls. I don't, I didn't want to go below 700 anyway, but I will be farming some rerolls, so we might be able to roll on him back on one point. But I did figure out something, you can actually, you don't have to grind for uh, Escanor, like the actual unit, you can just evolve it from this one, so let's quickly get that. Obviously he needs Essence, but I really hope they nerf him, hopefully it doesn't take that long, because if it takes them like a few weeks to do that, that's... Who's, who's grinding this Essence, bro? That stage is literally impossible. To be honest, I don't even care if they make it so it's not region locked, just to make it easier. It's that simple. Well, we got Escanor, obviously, but there's nothing really we can do till they fix that essence. And when I leave the AFK for Meliodas, we'll have like 10 of these axes, so I'm not worrying about that. But now, since there isn't really much for me to do, I guess we'll grind for Pain and Shanks. You know what, y'all? Change of plans. I cannot be asked to manually grind raids, so what I'm going to do is for like an hour to three, I'll AFK raids, probably Marines Ford, and then before I go to sleep, I'll set up the AFK for Meliodas or Aizen, so I think I'll catch up with y'all tomorrow and see if we got Shanks, Pain, Aizen, or Meli. And I changed my mind, let's quickly get something better on the GOAT. Alright, I should have kept all seen. There's so many more units I want to roll on, especially Aizen, that... You know what, if I just have some left over, then I'll come back to Rengoku, but... Yeah. But yeah, I guess I'll see you guys tomorrow morning, and hopefully I have some good news. Alright, y'all, so it's a new day, and eight hours of AFKing. The AFK worked, but we didn't get Meliodas. The only good thing we got from that is I got to max out the battle pass and a few quests, and we got more than we need for Escanor's axe. Now, obviously, this video is a noob to pro, but we're also covering, like, all the new units, so we have to get them at one point. So I'll set up the AFK, uh, but I kind of want to get him, so this time I could set up the AFK for Aizen, because this one I did for Melee. But what are those chances? Should this time I do, like, Purgatory? Does it, like, increase the chances? Because it doesn't show. But let me quit my app for now, and the Battle Pass, we got some of these, so let's see if we get anything good. Slowly but surely, we're getting to pity, but we just got Joker, 
and and bond so that's pretty cool now obviously i don't know how good these guys are but at the end of the day they are i got ss on damage but you can evolve both of them but the thing is all these new units need essence bro when are they gonna like make it so it's not region locked and make it so it's so it's not, bro they spawn in with 10 million hp but you? if they don't fix it i guess i'll figure something out i don't know but for now i can also evolve the unit because i have so many shards i don't know where I don't, maybe from capsules i don't know but we can evolve a uh, griffin now i want to do this guy last video but i was just so mentally drained but we can do him now so let's do that i ain't gonna roll on a single unit until it's four times uh weekend because and four times a weekend, I got my first glitched and a few overlords and avatars, so... Yeah, I'm probably gonna wait to roll on Griffith for now. Oh, I didn't even realize there's also, uh, this guy that, like, sits on a pillow. I don't know. And he has the same exact pose as Tatsu. This guy actually might be good. Because he has the same pose as Tatsumaki, I'm already gonna assume he's good. Uh, dude, I don't know what to really do besides AFKing, but, you know what, I was saving it for when I get Shanks, but I still haven't gone Shanks, so you know what, screw it, let's just evolve Smoker. One, two, good to have a, bro. Even though he's just a mythical, he's supposed to be, like, a crazy, like, multi-hit, and his multi-hit, like, makes him do ins- I don't know, but he's supposed to be good. Alright, y'all, well, I'm not gonna waste your time, so I'll catch up with you guys when either they- nerf the stage so i can actually work to evolve the units and when maybe i get something for my afk whether that's shanks aizen melee you know and i'll also be grinding a lot of units that i have right now their skill tree uh but yeah all the transition i totally didn't just sell my ukiora and having to grind for him all over again and now i've done over 30 runs and nothing yeah, that didn't happen. I don't know what I'm talking about. That Once I get my Ilkiora back, I will have some good news for y'all. I promise. You know what, dude? I literally can't be bothered just grinding that over and over. I'll set up an AFK at one point. But for one, we did get Meliodas, but it's not like we can even do anything because these... Essence, I literally can't do anything, bro. Can they please? They said on the Discord there would be a patch, so they better nerf it, bro, because there's literally nothing I can do. But tonight, I'm gonna set up the AFK farm for Aizen, so hopefully we can get him quick. And the other thing we got, we didn't get Shanks yet, but it will happen. Uh, we can literally evolve him right now, so I'm able to evolve. Why? Unlock. Evo. Right there. I don't know if he's good or not, but... Yeah. Every time I'm not on ALS, I set up an AFK farm for some rare rolls, so I think we can burn a little bit on Meliodas, because he's so rare. If he's a mid, that's just... I don't even know. He has to be good, bro. I'm going to spend, like, 200 at most on him. It's not four times a weekend, so I'm kind of scared, but hopefully we can get something good on him. The amount of hatred I have for this trait is beyond explaining. I am re-rolling that off with pride. No, Vulture's even worse. Oh. My. God. It's not even four times. I actually just pulled. If he's, if he's mid, I'm going to literally have a mental breakdown. I would. Oh, please be good, bro. No shot. I get another. I was literally thinking in my head. Yo, imagine if I get a glitch. He's hybrid on placement too. Oh my god. He, he has to be. I, I'm not. Please tell me he has like a godly form where he had, he gets like his purple aura, I don't know, and he gets like wings, you know, like the A version that he had. That'd be insane. Hopefully he's just good, I don't care uh, what Evo he has, just be good, man. I there's, I guess I'm... That, that's just crazy, but... <laughs> okay, I'm actually liking this luck right now, give me something good on this guy, the... The questionable, the uh, unit this is. Not unit, uh, character.
I want to roll this off so bad, but at the same time, I don't want to waste too many rerolls because when I get Benny Maru, bro, I'm burning all of my rerolls to the like get a uh, Avatar Overlord or Glitch because Benny Maru is such a goat. So I will come back to Griffith at one point because he's like a full AOE slow, I think, which is crazy. But dude, I actually can't believe we got glitched, especially that it's not four times weekend like i could imagine that maybe getting glitch on a four times weekend isn't as crazy but getting it when it's not is is crazy yeah dude there isn't really much i can really do manually in this game till they fix the elemental thing so in the meantime you already know the drill we're grinding for eyes and shanks maybe pain i don't know skill trees so roll the transition once again I know every time I say the roll the transition, I do the complete opposite. I will say roll the transition when I get what I want, and what I want is entrepreneur on this guy, because he is the best farm. So let's get it over with. It was bound to happen, dude. Like, I'm not even surprised. Let's go! But don't worry, even if the rerolls are looking pretty low and I say that I want to spend like a thousand on Benny Maru because Benny Maru is the GOAT, as I say, I will be leaving once in a while during the day an AFK farm for rerolls and it's a pretty good one. So don't worry, we will have more rerolls. But yeah, yeah, let's roll the transition now and dude, when I grind for Ilkiora, he better not take me like a hundred runs because the first Ilkiora I got Earlier in the video, it took, it took me only two runs, dude. Wait a minute. I did Okay, roll transition. Alright, y'all. So, I was literally just about to set up the AFK farm, but I decided I have so many shards. Why not convert them into, like, some shards that I've been missing to evolve Skull Knight? And Skull Knight is supposed to be really good, according to the wiki. And, I mean, Skull Knight's pretty cool, so let's evolve him. Turns into an ultimate, which is... Oh my god, what now? Okay, I guess I have the same problem in Anime Last Stand like I do in ASDD. I literally always forget about... Just get this guy over with. I'm racking up these ultimates like crazy, man. Hey, Jesus Christ. Okay, well, he's... Uh, I'm gonna be using this guy a lot in Infinite because he's supposed to be one of the best in Infinite, so... I can also max this guy's skill tree out, too. Now, I don't think there's any other units that I can evolve... That just requires shards, unless there is. Yeah, I think that's All it. Alright boys, so it's another day of the anime last stand grind, and I just woke up, but I did grind for Ulkiora, and we ended up getting two of him. Uh, I don't know how I got two of him, I don't even remember. And, in my AFK, we got four Shanks, and four more of Sengoku, so, Jesus. And we also got a lot more rerolls that I'm going to be spending a little bit on Shanks because I already got his evil material. To be honest, I could evolve all four Shanks if I wanted to. Look at those ray tokens, damn. Okay, right now I can barely talk because I just woke up, but let's evolve Shanks and roll on him. Those other Sengokus, I'm probably going to sell them because I don't even know if Sengoku's that good. I don't even know why I wasted those 40 precious common spear shards on him. Go, and I miss his old model though. This one looks cool, but the other one just went way harder. I wish I could also say, hey, let's start, let's also evolve Ukiora, but no, the elemental thing just has to be the hardest stage known to mankind. Okay, let me just quit yapping. So the trait we're hoping for, for Shanks, I don't even know his placement, but just for convenience, I'll take Overlord, Avatar. Okay, I don't know how I got glitched, man. I, I gen... I thought Glitch was a two placement limit, what happened to that? Yeah, well, any of those three traits, I'll take. And if I get Entrepreneur, I'm rolling that off in a millisecond. I've caught in Glitches. Already, dude. Without for 
What? Well, I don't even know how to react, dude. I'm too tired for this, but... Oh... I don't... Uh, 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 I can't even speak English. That's how flabbergasted I am, bro. You should see my face right now. I look like that one meme. But... God damn. Even if Shanks isn't even in the top 10 best units in the game, Shanks is Shanks, and... Oh my god. I wasn't even asking for that, too. I would have took an Overlord. That's... Oh my god. Bro, what is my... I think I've gotten more... Glitches than Overlords this video. What? Jeez, man, that's actually crazy. I gotta... Bro, all my glitches, I gotta max out their skill tree and level them up ASAP. Okay, maybe not Meliodas, because I think when I evolve them, it's gonna reset, but... God damn, I, that's crazy. Now that I think about it, I got a glitched every single day because I've been grinding for three days now and each day, on the first day, I got glitched uh, Shadow. Second day, I got glitched uh, Meliodas. And the third day, I got, which is today, I get glitched Shanks. Ooh, wow, okay, well, let me stop dragging this on. So right now, uh... To be honest, I don't even know. You know what, dude? I'm getting pain and then waiting for the patch because at the end of the day, it is a noob to pro, so I gotta get all the best units. Pain is insane. We're getting him. And to be honest, now that I think about it, once I get, like, all of these units... Because I'm gonna not... Like, I have to do something to grind, so I'm gonna be grinding out some unit skill tree and maybe, like, with all these good units that I'm getting and all these glitches... And with their max potential, maybe I'll actually be able to beat that elemental stage. Because maybe it's not hard at all. Maybe you just need, like, good units. You know what? Actually, I'm going to go reroll on Rengoku after I finish this. Because he is one of the only flame element that I have. And Rengoku is just insane in general. So hopefully we can get something good on him. Alright, right now we only have 363. But we will get more soon. Because the AFK grind for rerolls... I it was like 150 each night. Okay, no, we're not rolling that off. Hey, dude, I don't know how many times I've said AFK farm this video. Let me actually show up. So let's let's get something good on him because yes, fire. Uh, I mean, I don't know his placements, but ah, dude, I'm okay, I'm slowly running out low. Uh, nah, we're, we're, we're going for something better. Almost roll that off. Oh, okay, well, I, I'll gladly take that. I'll actually happily take that. Alright y'all, so I've been grinding for pain, and uh, surprisingly I've still been grinding for Aizen, I've been leaving an AFK, still nothing. So, I, I'm just so bored of this game right now, unless they fix it, like, I'm tired of doing nothing, dude. I want to evolve these units and get this video over with, so, yeah, I'm just gonna time skip to when they release the patch. In this exact moment, I'd actually rather play Royal High instead of Animism. An See how anime last stand makes me feel, bro. This this is I'm actually having a midlife crisis. I've had enough. I'm getting on Royal High. I can't hold it in anymore. Royal High, noob to pro? Question mark. All right, boys. So it's like a day later from my last recording, and I think what I'm gonna do with this video or like this update, this noob to pro, is I'm gonna split this uh video like covering this update into two parts. Like I'm already doing so much in this video that I feel like. I can save more stuff for a different video. And I also ended up evolving Kisame because he's a good water elemental. And now that elements matter, I guess I'm gonna have to like be getting good units of each elemental. All right, y'all, so I just woke up and I had an AFK and I can max out like four units skill tree, but they actually updated 
and they supposedly nerfed elemental cavern so now it's actually doable so i'm gonna try to solo it All right, here we are. Okay, let me speed this process up. No, right, let me try it on Nightmare. Maybe that's easier. <sighs> Dude, I still can't find people. Like, I'll add someone and I'll try to keep... Why did, d is it not, like... Fixing private servers where you rejoin, puts you in world 1, join world 2, it's in a public server. Like, I can't join people, dude. So, I don't know why that happens. Alright, before I end the video, let me evolve this guy because on episode 3, I'm gonna get Sunjin Wu and I'm gonna need this guy. So, let's evolve him. And I have like 600 raid tokens, so this, we should be able to get this. Alright, there we go. Hey, I didn't even notice, but while summoning for him, we got Shinra. And we already have Shinra's material, so maybe we can try to Evo him next uh, episode. But that's going to be it for now. Hopefully you guys enjoy this video. Obviously, I wanted to do more, but uh, I guess I'm just not, like, I don't have the best elements for each elemental stage. Part 2, I'm definitely going to be doing a lot more and getting a lot better units, but expect Part 2 probably when they fix that, because right now I can't really do anything, I can't beat the stage, I can't join people, so I can't really evolve any of the units, but yeah, I'm out. Peace. But trait luck, this video was actually insane.